What's going on YouTube? Your boy Mr. Crazy1870 and today we're going to be taking a look at the Switch Easy Reptile Case for the iPhone 4. Now the Reptile Case does retail at $28.99 and you can pick this up on Switch Easy's website. I will have their website in my video description. Make sure to check that out. Now the Reptile Case does come in four different colors. You got your black, green, brown, and purple. Here in front of me I do have the green one. As far as the packaging goes, you get the same exact packaging as the Switch Easy Capsule Rebel uh, for the iPhone 4 and also the Switch Easy Trim. Now in the package, Switch Easy also includes, you got your two universal dock adapters, you got your video stand, you got Switch Easy's logo, and here you got your 30 pin dock connector protector, which also matches the case. You got your squeegee. You also get a cleaning cloth. And you get two screen protectors. Your headphone jack protector. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at the reptile case for the iPhone 4. Now here in the back, it has a very distinctive crocodile skin texture for ultimate grip and style. Let's take a look at here on the inside of the case. Here on the inside, it feels very, very, very soft. Uh, your iPhone 4 is most definitely not going to get scratched up at all. Now here on the side, it is very, very flimsy. Take a look at here by the 30 pin dock connector. This here is very, very thin. If I were to pull this with a little bit more pressure, I'm pretty sure it will just snap. But it really doesn't matter because this is a two piece case and this is sort of like a frame that's just going to go right on top of it like this. I'm gonna go ahead and just install the reptile case onto the iPhone 4 and just give you a quick overview of the iPhone 4 with the case already installed. Now installation is really really easy. Go ahead and just grab your iPhone 4, place it into the case, and you're done with the back piece. And then go ahead and just grab your front piece and just align it here on the sides. Or you could just start from here on the top and make sure that. Just make sure that your buttons are aligned properly. And then just go ahead and just snap it in there. And you're done. Now let's take a look at here at the bottom. You got your cutout for your 30 pin dock connector. Another cutout for the speaker and the mic. Now I did try this with my third party iPhone 4 charger. Which in my case I am using a Belkin. And that Belkin is a little bit on the thick side. And I did not find any type of problems at all when it comes to using that charger. So you're most definitely not going to have any problems when it comes to using it with your original iPhone 4 charger. Here on the side, your volume buttons are covered. You get some pretty good feedback uh, when it comes to uh, pressing these volume buttons. Your vibrant sound switch, very nice cutout. Easy access, simply just put your thumb or your finger and just access that switch with any problems at all. Here you got your cutout for your headphone jack. Now I did try these with my iBeats and my Beats Pros. I did not find any type of problems when it comes to using these headphones. You're most definitely not going to have any problems at all uh, if you're using them with your original Apple headphones or even some skull candies. Here you got your sleep and wait button. It is covered also and you do get some very good feedback when it comes to hitting that switch also. You get a very good amount of a lip going all around the screen of the iPhone 4. So you get some very good amount of a lay on the table design. Now here in the back you do got one whole single piece cutout for the 5 megapixel camera and the LED flash. Now I did test out the flash uh, with the case on and personally I did not find any washed out pictures at all. So let's go ahead and install the 30 pin dock connector protector and show you how it looks with it already installed. Now this is green and it also matches the case which is really nice. Go ahead and install this and there you go. So this is very useful. Most definitely going to help from keeping away uh, any dust or lint from going into the 30 pin dock connector. Let's go ahead and install the headphone jack connector. This is also very easy. I'll go ahead and just, oops, just go ahead and align it and you simply just push. So that's how it looks with the headphone jack protector. Which is also very useful also just from any type of dust or any lint from getting into your headphone jack or even your 30 pin dock connector. Now let's take a look at the video stand. 
that switch is provided in the package. This is a very, very useful tool. You go ahead and just say you want to watch some YouTube videos and you feel you really do not feel like holding your iPhone 4 in your hands. You can simply just dock it like I have it on right now and just go ahead and just watch your YouTube videos or even just watch Netflix on it. So you can also view it with the iPhone 4 standing up, which looks really cool. I kind of wish that Switch Easy would have provided with uh, sort of like a green one to match the case instead of a white one. That is a quick look at the Switch Easy Reptile case for the iPhone 4. Please don't forget to like this video. It really helps me out a lot. Also, any questions you have in regards to the reptile case, feel free to drop me a line. I will try to get back to you guys as soon as I can. That's about it. Your boy, Mr. Crazy1870, signing out. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Lights.